and welcome back to Stan and Bang 6, Stan and Bang Hardcore. Next bout getting on the way here is a bit of a boxing match, two, three two minute rounds. Boxing in the red corner, uh, wearing the white trunk, you've got Roy Keldy representing Big Box Gym and his opponent, Pierce Ravenhill, fighting out of Team Truant in the black trunks and the heavily tattooed. Nice over hand right there by uh, Keldy. Ravenhill just seems to be a little bit on the defensive here. Referee Chris Batch dogs to take a quick look at these guys. There's not lots going on. He will separate them, but they stand back himself. Keldy really finding his range here with the jab and then throwing that big right. Although Ravenhill coming in close in the distance here. Looks like he was caught there with a shot. I'm not sure if it may have been a trip. It may have been a trip. I think he's signaling that he's fine. Ravenhill again, coming in low, coming into the body, trying to negate some sort of distance. Looking to really close his opponent down, go to work on the body and just throwing those big shots. Keldy on the other hand, looking to work off that jab. Keep his opponent in that, keeps his opponent at a nice distance and then throwing those big shots. Guys starting off at a really fast pace. It'll be interesting to see if they can maintain this. Still got three two-minute rounds in total for them to get through. Again, we see Raven Hill there. Closing the distance really quickly, coming in for the body shot for working upstairs. Nice left hand there from Raven Hill. Doesn't seem to have done too much to Keldy. Still covering up well. Nice little flurry of punches there. None of them really quite hitting the mark. Starting to fill the wear of the fight. Really already early on in round one. Pressurizing look at Raven in his face here. Looks completely focused with the task in hand. That jab a bit slower now than it was early on. That's the end of the first round. Okay, round two just about to get underway here. Be interesting to see if we have. A reoccurrence of the first round here, that being that Keldy working off that jab, look at those straight punches and Ravenhill countering by closing the distance and coming into the body. Free back still just having a word with uh, Ravenhill there, but low hands I believe. Yeah, nice stiff left out there from Keldy. Ravenhill looking like he's just sizing his opponent up again, going to the body, then the head. Seems to be working more for him so far, and again, as the fight game goes, if it's not broke, don't fix it. And that left to the body, for the right to the head. boxing bouts and even the K1 bouts we're going to have later on tonight. There is no clinching in the boxing. Chris Batchador will keep these guys at a fighting distance. And some of these body shots from Ravenhill are really starting to find the mark now. And look like they're slowing Keldy down quite considerably. He's come out explosive at the beginning of both rounds. But by about the halfway point, he seems to be very much on the defensive here. And here the crowd getting behind Ravenhill. It almost looks like he can, he can smell blood there. Now again, not hitting too flush, just glancing his opponent. And the snap from both of these fighters' punches just seems to be fading ever so slightly. Again, these guys have come out at such a fast pace initially that it's hard to maintain that pace throughout the entire fight. And also with Ravenhill throwing in these strong body shots, it's going to take the wind out of anyone. the end of round two. Third and final round, both of these fighters showing their mutual respect for each other. And again, let's see if we see Cowdy coming out exposed. Fight. Nice right cross there from Cowdy, really finding the mark. And Raven Hill covering up there. It looked like he may have been in a spot of bother, I'm not sure. 
seems to be recovering well. These guys both get into an absolute slugfest here in the last round. Nice right, nice right hand there from Ravens as well, finding the mark. Oh, looked like a slightly questionable punch there from Ravens, almost like a hammer fist. Not catching, so uh, the referee just batched or not saying anything now. Nice right cross there from Caldi. Some blood now starting to appear on the nose of Ravenhill. So some of these straight punches are coming through. He's swinging some wild lefts and rights, none of them quite hitting the mark. And again, going back to the body, served him well so far for the majority of this fight. The hands of Ravenshill dropping now as he's starting to feel the effects of the fight. We're in the final stretch now, halfway through the third round. Mouth wide open. You can see both of these guys breathing really heavily. Ravenhill certainly slowed right down. Nice little combination of punches there from Kelly. Looks like he always had Ravenhill in a spot of bother there. Up against the rope, but Ravenhill coming back. It's literally all heart, grit and determination at this stage of the fight. These guys are just flying on autopilot. Complete instinct coming in here. There's not too much thought. Big shots from both of these guys. Just slugging it out right to the end. Really giving the guys what they came, what they paid the hard-earned money for. Ravenhill just spitting blood out of his mouth now. Caught another couple of shots on the way out. And Keldy seems to be taking control. The crowd are going absolutely wild for this one. Batchelor keeping a close eye on these things, keeping the fighters separated. Both of these guys welted up, marked up, bruised up, breathing incredibly heavily, giving absolutely everything they've got. And that's what, that's what all the fight fans have come to see. That's the end of a cracking fight, electrifying stuff. Great to see. Ladies.